The University of Iowa Department of Pathology sits in a very rich environment that's created by University of Iowa Healthcare and the University of Iowa itself that has a very long tradition of excellence in education. The mission of the department, the way I would describe it, is to strive for excellence in serving the patients of today and preparing ourselves in the best way possible to serve the patients of tomorrow. I think one thing that makes Iowa in particular unique compared to a lot of academic uh, teaching institutions uh, really is the, the strong commitment to education that everyone across the board here has. We have a very balanced residency program and what I'm talking about is anatomic and clinical pathology. The surgical pathology program gives you a very solid uh, base of pathology upon which to build and, and advance your career in subspecialty fields. I don't think that our clinical or anatomic pathology training can really be beat anywhere. We do have graduated responsibility in our um, residency programs. So in the beginning, they have less responsibility as they become more competent. They actually have more responsibility. The other thing that I think we find is important is that we really have an emphasis that the residents see everything first. It doesn't go straight to faculty. The residents see it. They have to make a diagnosis and defend what they're doing so that they're comfortable really rendering diagnoses and practicing pathology actually during their residency. They're not passive um, observers in any of this. They're active participants. You get to take your best shot and told whether, yeah, you know, you're pretty much right or Maybe uh, I'd tweak the phrasing a little bit in this direction, but and for me, that's how I, I thought I'd learn best. Hands-on training just really makes a much more um, competent and confident pathologist. The more things you see, the more comfortable you are with them in any walk of life, and especially in pathology. In terms of our research mission, we have a lot of strengths already in the department and in the context of the university at large. We have a fairly strong program in immunology and we will keep building on that program in terms of studying immune-mediated diseases. Uh, we have a strong program in cancer biology, uh, looking at how cancer takes place and we will build on that uh, in the context of the University of Iowa Healthcare. And then we have a very unique enterprise in our department, probably one of a kind in the country in terms of comparative uh, pathology. Comparative pathology is a subspecialty in which animal models are studied and then compared to the human condition. Comparative pathologists have been called the guardians of translational research. And it is our mission to maximize the quality and relevance of translational research. I think our goal is to make the Division of Comparative Pathology an international leader in the field. As a neuropathologist, many of the things that I am dealing with diagnostically have to do with the diagnosis of muscle diseases. And to do that, patients undergo muscle biopsies. Individuals from all over North America send muscle biopsies here to have specialty testing done for muscular dystrophies. Uh, not only do we provide specific diagnoses, but then those individuals can become parts of clinical research programs. And we piloted using skin biopsies and growing fibroblasts from skin biopsies as another research tool. All those things together have become a repository of cultured cells and tissues that are part of a large muscular dystrophy center here that's funded by NIH. By using this diagnostic service to identify patients, we are enabling better and more rapid research getting patients toward therapies. I'm very proud of this department. We have a very good department. We have a collegial faculty, and I hope that we'll be able to continue that in the future. I think the way I see this department going is trying to be on this cutting edge of uh, the educational mission and also uh, promoting a healthy environment for uh, scientists and physician scientists to come and do disease-oriented research that can translate back 10 to 20 years from the time they do the research into real patient care abilities. The problem that pathology has is they're so good that everybody takes them for granted. So they're very much like an umpire in a good baseball game. You never know they're there. 
You know, they do their job day in, day out, process tens of thousands of samples, you know, every month, basically flawlessly. I would strongly recommend this program to others. I've been very, very happy here, both on a personal and professional um, basis, and I really can't think of having gotten better training anywhere else.